Hi, I am Om, and this is my PowerPoint presentation for the 2021-2022 Houston Science Fair. So, let's get started. So, the problem. The ill-timed signal lights on Bay Area Boulevard re result in congestion, high travel time, higher fuel consumption, and air pollution that can be avoided. The braking and idling at red lights contributes, significant, uh, contributes a significant amount to air pollution, which can be avoided. In 2021, so my research, in 2021, Americans used estimated 134 billion gallons of motor, sorry, 134 billion gallons of motor gasoline or 370 million gallons per day. Idle vehicles use amount, uh, approximately one, uh, one uh, sorry, a half a gallon per hour. Hypothesis. Poor signal light timing leads to poor traffic conditions, excessive fuel usage, and avoidable emissions. If signal lights are synchronized better to ensure the traffic on busy streets the, of the area flows with minimum to no red light encounters, the drivers could will not only benefit from fuel cost savings, but also the surrounding area will benefit from the reduced air pollution in the neighborhood. For example, Bay Area Boulevard, Boulevard has a daily traffic of 42,000 cars compared to the uh, 2,100 cars on Gemini Avenue. Materials. I used a car driver uh, with, uh, with a, a license, a proper driving license, which was my dad for me, paper to uh, paper and pen to record the timing and then a stopwatch to actually find the timings. So my procedure says slash study design. So to prove my hypothesis, I used a po portion of Bay Area Boulevard between Middlebrook and I-45 and completed eight trips, eight trips between the two points and collected data to support my hypothesis. I timed the travel between each cross street, the time it took to complete the whole trip and the number of times we encountered red lights. The trip was were com the trips were completed over different times of the day to include peak and off-peak hours, so the data represents all traffic conditions. Driving was done strictly adhering the speed limit of 40 miles per hour. Procedure. So, uh, get a trusted adult. Start driving on Barrio Boulevard to Middlebrook intersection towards the I-45 intersection. Start the uh, stopwatch as your trip begins. Note down the time ta taking to travel between two signal lights and note down if the signal uh, was green or red at a live arrival. Calculate the time taken to complete the trip. Note down trip trip start time, date and day of time, weather conditions, any unusual road conditions or traffic incidents, any other condition that may affect the results like COVID-19, uh, Thanksgiving break, ETC. Calculate the average time taken per trip and compare it with the ideal times that needed to complete the trip if there are no signal lights. Calculate ex excess fuel usage because of the excess driving time resulting from mismanaged traffic lights. Okay, so this all data is collected by me personally. So, like, we started at zero seconds, and then when we got to the first intersection, it was 27 seconds, and it was a green light. Next intersection, 40, it was at 46 seconds, and it was still a green light. So the next intersection, it was uh, blue. Sorry, uh, we had a red light. So uh, you can see that, so uh, we stopped at 52 seconds and we had to wait there for 75 seconds. So then it started again, like that. And uh, again, like I say, uh, over these next three slides, uh, it'll show all the data is collected personally by me um, during the trips. So after this, we have the calculation of statistical analysis where we find how much money was wasted, how many gallons were wasted, and how much CO2 was released into the air. So our results were 971,000 gallons per year, uh, gallons of gasoline were wasted per year, $2.9 million were wasted each year, and 19 million pounds of CO2 was wasted each year, which is a lot, obviously. And then my conclusion. The data collected during this experiment and mathematical calculation fully support my hypothesis and poor synchronization of signal lights on Bay Area Boulevard between Middlebrook Drive and I-45 result in excessive t uh, travel time, fuel consumption, and associated emissions in the neighborhood. My calculations demonstrate that poor signal light synchronization on Bay Area Boulevard results in 971,162 gallons per year of gasoline wasted per year, extra full cost of $1.9 million for drivers, <clears throat> and 19 mi million pounds of CO2 emissions that can be avoided. So a solution would be, would be better traffic light synchronization, which could, which could definitely uh, be changed. Cause it's it's an easy thing.
And this isn't really a solution that's taking much money. So, like, you're getting the biggest bang for your buck. Like, you're not really having to pay money. Like, while the government's trying to pay all this money to, uh, to stop pollution, this is an easy solution to a big problem. And so, think about it. So, let's just say there are 10 cities, uh, 10 streets, in, 10 streets like Burial Boulevard in, a, in every metro city. Let's just say there are 10 metro cities in the U.S. Assuming... Ten such streets with a nation need proper traffic signalization. Then, uh, about ninety-seven million gallons uh, of gasoline would be wasted per year. Two hundred ninety-one million dollars uh, is wasted per year because of unnecessary uh, gasoline wasted, and then about one point nine billion pounds of carbon dioxide released into the air. And this is my presentation. Thank you.